Hello and welcome to today's lesson. This is the Veracity PDE Salt Question Bank. Updates for describe image 2018. You may get multiple graphs, tables, photographs, pictures, illustrations, diagrams, or maps. You want to understand the key updates in the scoring criteria for June 2018. Higher and emphasis on fluency that means that taking pauses is going to be really detrimental you want to really uh, work on simple phrases that you can use to boost your fluency that ensure that you can fill up that space while you think so the first thing you want to do before we begin attempting this test is to memorize these five phrases the first line this image presents information regarding and then all of these as we form the other sentences it can be seen that so the next part is the what is visible here is the well it can be said that so these basic phrases are to be kept in mind and I will illustrate just now how to use them the second main update in terms of the scoring is the intonation or the voice modulation aspect a lot of men because they have heavier throats uh, we are noticing a score decline because the voice is not registering so of course the position of the mic the volume all of that does matter so please make sure that you get your speech tested get some feedback on that so that you understand uh, what kind of score you're getting or you can also take the official score test on the Pearson website to just understand that if you're getting a 10 20 or 30 on your speaking means that there is a major issue with your intonation your voice itself okay uh, so please take care of that let's get get started we are going to solve some latest 2018 questions which have appeared on the test in may 2018 or the first week of june 2018 i'm going to be deploying these five phrases just to show you how they build fluency so remember that the specific details of the content of the image are not as important fluency is the single biggest scoring criteria This image presents information regarding the correct positioning of the hands and the fingers with respect to the keyboard while typing. The correct way is that your hands are straight and fingers are vertically aligned with the keyboard and your wrists are not touching the keyboard. The wrong way to do this, which is highlighted in red color in the image, is if your fingers and hands are slanting uh, or if your thumbs are under the keyboard or if your wrists are resting on the keyboard. These are the things that should not be done while typing correctly. This map presents information regarding the wide variety of vegetation types found in India. We can see the vegetations listed on the right hand side, alpine vegetation right on top in the northern states. Uh, the yellow area is the one which occupies the largest proportion of the map which is tropical dry uh, vegetation as well as other kinds of vegetations there are some parts which are highlighted in green color as well which indicate the tropical dry evergreen or the tropical evergreen kinds of forests and vegetations The image presents information regarding the relative sizes of various planets in the solar system with respect to each other. We can clearly see highlighted that Jupiter is the biggest planet 
and followed by Saturn which is the second biggest the smallest planets are shown right in front uh, starting with the earth and Pluto being the smallest which is highlighted there are other two medium-sized planets which are depicted in this photograph uh, or illustrated diagram which are Uranus and Neptune this kind of a model where the relative sizes are depicted make it easier for us to see how the planets are uh, with respect to each other This image presents information regarding the various growth stages depicted in the form of the size or the length of the fish for the species southern black bream, also known as the Acanthopagrus butchery. Uh, the, the text on the image also indicates that a lot of them are being um, killed and consumed and therefore because of the long growth cycle and long breeding cycle it is requested to uh, release them back into the ecosystem and therefore this is the black bream growth stages uh, shown in this image This image presents information regarding the various stages in the life cycle of an animal known as the frog which actually starts by laying eggs which then develop into embryos. The next stage is that the embryos get converted into a tadpole and it generates legs as well as the capability to breathe. Uh, through pulmonary systems and this is when the transformation from the tadpole to the frog happens and we can clearly see depicted that the adult frog is then also finally able to come on land. This map conveys information regarding the number of hours using six different categories uh, indicated with various colors uh, of the amount of the sunshine that France receives. Uh, on the map, also labeled on the left hand side, is the Charente Maritime uh, to indicate the time zone. We look at it and we see that the northern areas receive the least amount of sunshine, that is less than 1750 hours, whereas the southernmost regions towards the east receive more than 2750 hours and the other regions receive various numbers in between these ranges. This image presents information regarding some of the world's tallest building listed in the form of an infographic or illustrated uh, buildings with the heights indicated in the vertical axis. The tallest building in the world is the Burj Khalifa and uh, the least tallest building out of all of the ones that are depicted in this image are the Petronas Towers. There are four other buildings that fall in the median range between these. On, namely the Shanghai Tower, the Taipei 101, the Shanghai World Financial Center and the International Commerce Center.
This image presents a lot of important information in two parts. The first part, we can clearly see that there is evidence of the growth of a tree in the form of the number of rings that it has. A cross section of these rings that are depicted in this image has been taken down as a form of the second part of the image where it depicts that the variations of the tree growth during different climates can also be mapped through the rings uh, on the left hand side the warmer climate uh, is visible and there are more gaps between the rings whereas in the cooler climate there the rings are more narrowly compressed This image conveys information regarding the position of the sketch of a boy who is standing in this illustration with his arms akimbo. Both his arms are on his sides uh, and the elbows are bent and this position is indicated with the help of this sketch. What is also clearly evident and visible through this illustration is that this is a straight position that is being held by the person that is depicted and we can see that this is a black and white sketch which provides us all of this information. The photograph depicts the formation of a supernova through a massive explosion and starburst and the depiction of the powerful energy in the form of light being sucked into this black hole. There is a swirling mass all around the black hole which also indicates uh, the sort of violent forces that are acting in the form of gravity to pull all of this light towards its center and this uh, uh, phenomenon is something that is happening in the universe in the galaxy and also informs our understanding of space and therefore the formation of a, of a black hole looks like this The set of three diagrams uh, provided to us indicate uh, the psychological process known as classical conditioning. In the first one, the response is completely unconditioned where the dog is looking at the food and his tongue is out and he is drooling. In the second one, we are training the dog to uh, salivate only once he hears the, uh, the bell ringing which is when he is uh, provided uh, with the food as well. Uh, by the third uh, picture, we can see the conditioning taking effect where the dog salivates simply at the ringing of the bell with no food present. This table provides us a data regarding some of the most popular languages that are spoken across the world uh, and the data is for 10 different languages along with the number of speakers uh, indicated in the two columns. The most popular language in the world is Chinese or Mandarin as listed in the bracket and we see that there are around 1 billion speakers of this language which is highly popular. Uh, the second one is English followed by various other languages uh, such as Hindustani, Spanish, Russian, Arabic, Bengali, Portuguese, Malay, Indonesian and the last one is the French.
This picture presents us information about different flags of various countries. Uh, we see that all the flags have a, a variety of combination of colors along with the geometrical shape present on the left hand side. Now the first one is Jordan which has a red triangle similar to Palestine with a little bit of variation that it has a star on its triangle. Sudan has a green triangle and Kuwait and United Arab Emirates also have three stripes in the flag but the um, the geometrical shape on the left hand side is different. UAE has a rectangle and Kuwait has a trapezoid shape. This illustration provides us details regarding the working of solar yard lights by indicating a clear a cross section of the various layers beginning with the topmost one which is the glass cover which is closely followed by uh, the solar cells uh, and there is a photoresistor which is very small in size which is placed into uh, that whole unit and the details of uh, that uh, unit under it there are batteries, controller board and LED, all of which are present inside it, the various components and at the end is the lamp cover. This set of comparative photographs of a cityscape present information regarding the changes that have taken place from the year 1942 versus 2014. And the photograph on the left hand side is black and white whereas the photograph on the right hand side is colored. Uh, we see that the vehicles are also old and on the right hand side you can see newer kinds of cars on the road. We also see a variation in the building, construction and architectural design. Uh, it is much more modern in the right hand side in the year 2014. Okay, so I hope that these real life attempts, these sort of impromptu, spontaneous attempts have helped you really see that, uh, you know, this is very normal. You will get a 79 plus even if you make a few errors here and there. As long as you keep t talking, you don't take any major pauses, your accent and pronunciation is mainly like native, like focus on your voice modulation, focus on your accent, focus on your fluency. Please remember that you can actually solve all of the repeated questions, right? It is not a university exam with a set syllabus that, oh, I've done all of the repeated question bank and my job is done. Do not approach it like that. Please make sure that you want to get your speech evaluated. You want to take a mock test. You want to take some feedback. You want to work on identifying your biggest problem areas and then address those areas. That is what you want to do. There is no point practicing without guidance or without understanding that where is it that I am messing up, right? What is the biggest uh, thing that is actually bringing down my score? So please note that yes, having all of these questions is great, but it is definitely not sufficient. The critical factor is the improvement that you will see once you start identifying your problems, whether they are practical problems like working with the mic, like, you know, the font size, the image, whatever it is, right? Remember that what you say is not as important now in your, uh, you know, describe image as as, as much as how you say it. So they have really stepped up the game on the fluency and on the native like accent. So please make sure that you work on that. If you have any queries or you want to avail the training program, you can send in a mail to us at restymentors.org at gmail.com. All the best. Study hard. Keep preparing. And I hope this lesson was helpful to you.